Hey guys, what's up? For those of you that don't know me, my name is Chrisanna, and if you're new here, then welcome. And if you're an oldie, welcome back. So guys, in today's video, we're going to be testing out the new lipsticks by Milani. Let me go ahead online and pull up what these are actually called, you guys. I think these are the fetish lipsticks. Let me go ahead and pull it up really quickly. So I got these at Ulta and they retail for $8.99. They came out with five or six shades. I've only got three, the three that I thought would interest me. Okay, so yes, these are called the Milani Color Fetish Matte the Nudes Collection. So I got one in the shade Tease. I got one in the shade Pleasure. And then the last one is in the shade Desire. So I was really excited to try these out, you guys. I usually don't ever buy brand new lipsticks. Anytime I get a lipstick, it's usually because it's on sale or it's like a cheaper brand. So when these came out, I was really excited because I'm so into nudes. Like nudes are definitely my thing. So yeah, in today's video, we're going to be going ahead and trying these out and swatching these all on our lips. So if you guys want to see exactly how I'm going to do that and how these lipsticks perform and what they look like, go ahead and keep on watching. So I went ahead and removed the old lipsticks. So let's go ahead and jump in with these lipsticks. So let's start with the lightest shade and then we'll work our way up to the darkest. So the lightest shade is in the shade 420 Tease. Gosh, you guys, that is such a light, pretty pale nude. I feel like this would look really well with like a darker lip liner. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch on the back of my hand that I'm also going to apply on my lips. Oh, you guys, feels really creamy. That is a beautiful, beautiful shade. So honestly, you guys, I'm not going to do any lip liners. I want to actually see how these apply just on their own. Let's go ahead and start applying it. Honestly, you guys, I love the shade. It does feel creamy, even though it's matte. It doesn't feel too drying on the lips. And honestly, yeah, I love the shade. I definitely think it would pair better with a darker lip liner. Other than that, I love it. I'm gonna go ahead and wipe that off. Apply the next one. So next one is Pleasure. So this is more of a pinkish color. That's what it looks like. Again, I'm gonna apply in the back of my hand and then apply in the lips. So again, it feels very, very creamy. So I guess actually this would be considered the lightest one because this is 410. The last one was 420. But again, very creamy. I love the shade. It is a little bit too light for me. But again, with a darker lip liner, I think it would look really good. But I felt like it would be better to apply without a lip liner just to kind of show you guys what they would look like on their own. But honestly, I see people on YouTube that do lip swatches of like 10 or more lipsticks. And I honestly don't know how they do it. Literally, my lips are already sore with it just... The lipstick I had them before and then doing those two. The last one, you guys, this is in the shade Desires. So this is one of the deepest ones. It's not the deepest, but it is one of the deepest. So this looks like it has kind of like a red undertone to a more like a chocolate brown. Let's go ahead and put it on the back of the hand. Oh no, you guys, that is actually a really nice brown. I like more of like a not necessarily a cool tone brown, but like in the middle. I don't really like a brown with a red undertone. I like a true brown. Try to be very careful because browns can be super messy. All right, you guys, don't mind that lip swatch. That looks like absolute crap. But can we just, like, look at this color? This is absolutely amazing, you guys. I definitely recommend applying this one with a brown lip liner just so that way it's easier to put it on the lips. Absolutely love them. They smell really good. They are matte, but they're also very creamy. They do not make my lips feel dry. So what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to go off camera. I'm going to take this off. I'm going to use the Morphe Lip Liner in Sweet Tea. And then I'm going to fill the lips in with the shade Tease. All right, guys, so here is, again, the Morphe Lip Liner in Sweet Tea. And then the Milani Fetish Lipstick in the shade... Almost forgot tease. And again, absolutely love this combo. I feel like on its own, this would be too light for me. But if you're like super fair, I'm, I feel like you could rock this really well. Even if you're not, I mean, just wear whatever you want. But personally for me, I definitely like it with a darker lip liner. But honestly, guys, how do I feel about these lipsticks? I absolutely love them. They are matte, but they're not too drying. They are very creamy for being matte. 
I did see a couple people review these and say they did not like them, but that's not the case for me. I absolutely love them and that's fine. Not everybody always loves what everybody else loves. Again, three lipsticks. They retail for $8.99 on Ulta's website. Now, I'm not sure if you want like Milani's website, what they retail for. They're probably actually cheaper. Ulta definitely is one of the most expensive makeup stores. Walmart might be getting these as of right now. I'm not sure. Same with Amazon. Like again, I did pick mine up at Ulta. So yeah, if you guys like this video and you guys found this video helpful, please let me know down in the comment section below. If there's anything at all that you guys want to see next, please let me know. And I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see you next time.